your news now sports. As much as people like to talk about the differences from generation to generation, it seems there's at least one constant, whether you're Gen X or Gen Z or any of the rest. In fact, not only are summer basketball camps still thriving, but there seem to be even more options in the current day and age. The University of Finley has been offering local hoops lovers the opportunity to work on their game for years. From their June team camps to this week's individual camps, the Oilers spend their summers concentrating on the next generation of Northwest Ohio basketball players. Led by associate men's head coach Dan Shardo, UF this week welcomes more than 300 kids from grades 1 through 12, playing on seven different courts across three different gyms with help from current and former players from both the men's and women's hoops teams, as well as their young assistant coaches and members of other local high school and college programs. This week's camp will try to cover as many bases as possible. It's a camp for both, you know, boys and girls, and definitely it's a camp for beginners up through a little bit more advanced. And that's kind of the difference between the morning and the afternoon. You know, the morning session is definitely going to be a little bit more of your beginner level even though we'll have some advanced kids there. And then in the afternoon, we call it that specialty camp where you can do you can do a concentration. You can go on the guard skills, the post skills, or shooting, and we'll break you off into to working on that specific skill set for, say, the first half of that afternoon camp. Chardo says that the work they put in during the summer is well worth it, not only in developing the game, but also the university's reputation. It is a point of pride for the man running the show that it continues to grow each offseason. We've been running this camp for ever since I've been here 15 years, and it continues to grow. Anytime you can put kids on your campus, that's a great thing for the university. Uh, great, like I said, thing for our men's basketball program. Um, I do think, you know, it's something that has been built over uh, a long period of time. When I first started this, we probably about had maybe a third of those numbers. So I think we're doing something right with the camp.